Dreams. We all experience them. But what exactly do they mean? Why do we have dreams? Is there any psychological significance behind them? Dreams are the wellspring of creativity, the canvas upon which our innermost thoughts and emotions are painted. They are the key to unlocking the mysteries of our subconscious mind. In this manuscript, we will embark on a profound exploration of dreams, seeking to unravel their enigmatic nature, understand their significance, and delve into the intricate tapestry of the human psyche. Dreams are the nocturnal voyages of the mind, a realm where the ordinary and the extraordinary collide. They are not merely fragmented images or disjointed stories. They are windows into the complex labyrinth of our inner worlds. Dreams can be vivid and exhilarating, bizarre and surreal, or haunting and enigmatic. Each dream is a unique voyage, an intricate puzzle waiting to be deciphered. Dreams have been a source of fascination for humanity throughout history. They have inspired great works of art, literature, and scientific inquiry. Ancient civilizations, from the Egyptians to the Greeks, believed that dreams held prophetic significance. In the Bible, dreams played a pivotal role in conveying divine messages and guiding the course of history. As we journey deeper into the world of dreams, we must first understand the science behind them. Dreams primarily occur during a phase of sleep known as rapid eye movement, REM. During this phase, our brain activity increases and our bodies become temporarily paralyzed to prevent us from acting out our dreams physically. It is during REM sleep that we experience the most vivid and memorable dreams. Dreams are not a monolithic experience. They encompass a wide spectrum of emotions, themes, and symbolism. Some dreams are joyful and exhilarating, leaving us with a sense of euphoria upon waking. Others are puzzling and surreal, defying logical interpretation. Nightmares, on the other hand, plunge us into a realm of fear and dread, leaving us shaken and unsettled. Nightmares, in particular, hold a unique place in the realm of dreams. They are the harbingers of our deepest fears, the echoes of unresolved conflicts that lurk in the shadowy corners of our minds. Nightmares are the unsettling journeys into the dark recesses of our psyches, where our deepest anxieties and traumas await resolution. Many psychologists have delved into the psychological significance of nightmares. Traditionally, nightmares have been viewed as negative psychological events that torment us and disrupt our sleep. They are often triggered by external stressors or traumatic memories. The focus has been on mitigating their frequency or eliminating them through medication. However, what if nightmares serve a deeper purpose? Nightmares occur for a reason. They are not mere glitches in the dream world, but powerful messages from our subconscious minds. By focusing solely on their pathology, we risk missing the valuable insights they offer. Nightmares, in fact, can be the most substantial and therapeutically valuable dreams. They awaken us with a jolt, forcing us to confront our deepest conflicts and emotions. Within the realm of nightmares, there exist typical dream motifs that have been the subject of fascination and analysis. Falling, being unprepared for a presentation or exam, losing teeth, feeling trapped, encountering monsters, or facing natural disasters. These motifs are common, but by no means simple. They are the building blocks of our nightmares, each carrying its own symbolism and significance. One of the earliest recorded nightmares in history can be traced back to Lilith, whose name means night monster or night hag in Hebrew. In Jewish legend, Lilith was Adam's first wife, a rebellious spirit banished from the Garden of Eden. She transformed into a nightmare or Lamaya, becoming a symbol of danger and darkness. Lilith's story transcended cultures and influenced folklore across ancient Mesopotamia, where she became associated with succubi and incubi creatures that haunted the night. The term nightmare has its roots in Anglo-Saxon and Norse mythology, where it referred to malevolent beings that visited people at night, causing terrifying dreams. These nocturnal intruders were believed to sit on the chests of their victims, inducing feelings of suffocation and dread. Similar entities, known as Alps in Germany, were said to enter rooms through the tiniest openings, bringing nightmares to those they encountered. The fear of nightmares led to the development of various charms, prayers, and spells used to ward off malevolent dream visitors. Symbols and protective rituals have been employed across cultures to ensure peaceful slumber. 
In Japanese mythology, the Baku, a chimera-like creature, was summoned to devour nightmares. However, one had to be cautious, as an unsatiated Baku could devour one's hopes and dreams as well, leaving a life devoid of meaning. Understanding nightmares requires delving into the intricate phases of sleep, non-rapid eye movement, non-REM sleep, and rapid eye movement. REM sleep are the two primary states that characterize our sleep cycles. Nightmares predominantly occur during REM sleep, the phase associated with heightened brain activity and vivid dreams. The mysteries of sleep cycles continue to captivate researchers and dream enthusiasts alike. Night terrors are distinct from nightmares, occurring during non-REM sleep, particularly in stage 3, which is characterized by deep slumber. Night terrors are intense episodes of waking up in a state of terror, often accompanied by physical symptoms such as rapid heart rate, heavy breathing, and profuse sweating. These episodes are shrouded in darkness, and their content remains elusive, making them a mysterious phenomenon. Perhaps the most intriguing type of dream is the precognitive or prophetic nightmare. These dreams offer a glimpse into the future, presenting terrifying visions that later come to pass in reality. Such dreams challenge our understanding of time and the connection between the conscious and unconscious mind. While precognitive dreams are relatively rare, they have been reported throughout history and continue to spark debate among scientists, scholars, and those who have experienced them. Precognitive dreams are often characterized by their eerie accuracy. People who experience them may dream of specific events, such as accidents, natural disasters, or personal crises, and then witness those events unfold in real life, sometimes days, weeks, or even years later. These dreams defy conventional explanations and challenge our understanding of the boundaries of human cognition. Scientific investigations into precognitive dreams remain in their infancy. Skeptics argue that such dreams can be explained by coincidence or selective memory, where individuals remember the dreams that seem to predict the future while forgetting those that did not. However, there are compelling anecdotes and documented cases that suggest otherwise. The phenomenon of precognition has been likened to the Cassandra syndrome, named after the mythological figure Cassandra, who possessed the gift of prophecy but was cursed never to be believed. Those who experience precognitive dreams often find themselves in a similar predicament, struggling to convince others of their visions until events transpire as foreseen. The renowned Swiss psychiatrist Carl Jung delved deep into the realm of dreams and the unconscious mind. He introduced the concept of the collective unconscious, a reservoir of shared human experiences, symbols, and archetypes that shape our dreams and the stories we tell. Jung believed that dreams were a gateway to this collective unconscious, offering insights into the universal human experience. Jung's exploration of dreams led him to identify archetypes, universal symbols and themes that appear in dreams across cultures and time periods. These archetypes, such as the hero, the shadow, and the anima, animus, provide a rich tapestry of symbolism in dreams. They speak to the human condition and reveal the deeper layers of our psyche. Dream analysis often involves deciphering the symbolism within dreams. Every element in a dream, from objects and animals to people and locations, can carry symbolic meaning. For example, water in dreams is often associated with emotions, while flying may symbolize liberation or a desire for escape. Understanding these symbols can provide profound insights into the dreamer's psyche. No discussion of dreams would be complete without mentioning Sigmund Freud, the founder of psychoanalysis. Freud believed that dreams were a pathway to the unconscious mind, where repressed desires, conflicts, and traumas resided. He famously asserted that dreams are the royal road to the unconscious. Freud's interpretation of dreams laid the foundation for modern dream analysis. Freud distinguished between the manifest content of dreams, the surface level, apparent storyline, and the latent content, the hidden, symbolic meaning behind the dream. He proposed that dreams allowed the mind to express forbidden or unconscious desires in a disguised form. Analyzing the latent content was, according to Freud, the key to understanding the true meaning of dreams. Contemporary approaches to dream analysis incorporate elements of both Jungian and Freudian theories, as well as insights from cognitive neuroscience. Therapists and psychologists often use dream analysis as a tool for exploring the inner workings of the mind 
and addressing psychological issues. It can be a valuable tool for uncovering repressed emotions, resolving conflicts, and gaining self-awareness. Lucid dreaming is a fascinating phenomenon in which the dreamer becomes aware that they are dreaming while still within the dream. This awareness allows the dreamer to exert some degree of control over the dream's narrative and environment. Lucid dreaming has been studied for its therapeutic potential, as it offers a unique way opportunity to confront fears, practice new behaviors, and explore the boundaries of consciousness. Dreams are not confined by the laws of physics or reality. In dreams, we can defy gravity, travel through time and space, and interact with fantastical creatures. This boundless creativity within our dreamscape highlights the infinite possibilities of the human imagination. It reminds us that our minds are capable of constructing entire universes, both wondrous and terrifying. Throughout history, dreams have inspired countless works of art, literature, music, and scientific discoveries. The vivid imagery and emotional depth of dreams have fueled the creative endeavors of artists, writers, and thinkers. From Salvador Dali's surreal paintings to Mary Shelley's Frankenstein, dreams have left an indelible mark on human culture and creativity. In conclusion, dreams are a multifaceted and enigmatic realm that continues to captivate and mystify us. From the depths of our subconscious mind, they bring forth a tapestry of emotions, symbols, and experiences. Dreams offer us glimpses into the collective unconscious, the hidden recesses of our psyche, and even the tantalizing possibility of precognition. As we continue to explore the uncharted territories of dreaming, we find ourselves on a journey of self-discovery, creativity, and self-healing. Whether we seek to unravel the symbolism within our dreams, harness the power of lucid dreaming, or simply revel in the boundless landscapes of our imagination, dreams remain an integral part of the human experience, an ever-present reminder that our inner worlds are as vast and complex as the universe itself.